family, it's the Mobile Home Diva, and in today's video, we're gonna be touring the single wide home. This is a Westfield classic, you guys. I'ma go too fast. I don't care about those limits. Cause I want this to last like nothing ever lasts before. I'ma go too fast. Suddenly I feel so rich. No, I don't know nothing. No, I can't let this slip, slip. I've toured two Westfield classics in the past. One was a double wide and one was a single wide, two bedroom, one bath. So this one, I believe is a three bedroom, two bath, and it is super cute. Let's go in and take a look, okay? Pretty, look at the flooring. The flooring is so pretty. I love the wide planks. I don't know if the camera's doing the color any justice. It is absolutely beautiful. Love it. So I just came in from that door. You got all of this living room space over here. I'm gonna back up so you can really see it. Got all of this living room space. Let's go back on the other side of the door. Really pretty. Hope it's got some decor picks online so you can really see. Really nice. You got this tall counter here. You could put a bar stool or two. Depending on how they made, you can put two bar stools up there. I like that it has the overhang. So it's a true island. And then here's the kitchen. I love the light, the dark wood and the light countertops. Super, super pretty. Sometimes single wives don't have the sink over the kitchen. Um, uh, the window over the kitchen sink, but this one does love it. Actually love the dark wood in here because it has the light floors. So pretty. This is a pretty home. Give you an idea what it looks like to put a smaller dining room table in um, a smaller space. So you, they've got a small, and you can even go smaller than that. You can do a two uh, table that fits two chairs right there, depending on who's living there, right? If it's just you and your husband, or if it's just you, you can do a smaller table than this. Really pretty. Really nice, love it. Let's go see what the guest bedrooms look like. All right, go down this long hallway. We'll go to the end, to the first guest bedroom. Really pretty. I always have to open the closet. So I wanna know, I always wanna know what the closet space is like. So you got standard closet there. It's the first guest bedroom, no carpet. In here, you guys, more and more we're seeing houses with no carpet and surprisingly, the single wives with no carpet. So awesome. Guest bathroom is here, standard bathroom, but really pretty nonetheless. So that's the guest bathroom. Just missing a transom window, right? And then guest bedroom number two. This, the other one was long, 
This one is more square. It could work with a twin bed in here, but if you don't need to put a bed in here, this will be a nice office space. Awesome. So there's your back door just past the kitchen. No peeping at the price. You got your across from the back door. You can you got your utility area. Wash and dryer goes there. It sits back far, further enough where it doesn't feel like it's in the hallway. And that's what I like. You have to actually walk up to the washer and dryer and you got this space here really nice i would probably put a door with a window here at the back door i don't like those doors like that that are not front doors and then this is the master bedroom really nice You've got your master closet right here. So it goes back there. You could put a little shelf in this way and you could put a little shelf in this way to make it a true walk-in, right? Really nice. All right, let's look at the master bath. Right away when you're walking up, you have a single sink. I love the, the different shape of this counter. It gives you actually more counter space here. So that's super cute. Your toilet is over here. You got a window, a frosted window that actually opens. As you can see right there, you can open this window. And you even have space if you want to put some, some additional something or other, maybe a a ladder book, um, a ladder shelf or something there to hang towels or put additional toiletries and stuff on. You got space over there for that. And then you got a nice big garden tub and shower combo. Got your little footstool or sitting area right there, um, which is always a plus. Really nice. Not bad, not bad at all. I like it. Again, this is a Westfield Classic. Um, 14 by 66 is a three bedroom, two bath. Total price is $52,995. That's everything included in the price. Hope you guys enjoyed this home. I think it's really lovely. And I'm so happy to be able to share these homes with you. If you uh, like these videos, please give me a thumbs up. Comment, share, and subscribe, okay? Make sure you hit the notification bell so you know every time I upload a video. Thanks so much for watching.